guys, how's it going? So today I filmed my uh, tour of kind of this area where I play uh, World of Warcraft and Heroes of the Storm and any other games on my PC, desktop, computer. Um, I used to have a laptop and everything and now I have a desktop so it's super nice. Um, so I just kind of wanted to show you guys all of my awesome World of Warcraft collection essentially and my chair and uh, all that type of stuff. Um, I am going to be getting a second monitor soon. Sorry, I'm literally like starting up a game right now and that's hella loud. Um, but I'm going to be getting a second monitor soon and then hopefully streaming on Twitch once I do that. Uh, the main reason I never really got into Twitch was because um, I used to play on a laptop which was like pretty old so every time I tried to stream it would like freeze and lag and just stupid stuff like that. Also I got my favorite map Sky Temple on Heroes of the Storm and I'm so excited. Um, but yeah, once now that I have a desktop computer and once I do get my second monitor I should be like all good to go because my main issue was the lagging but that's fixed with my new computer and secondly not having another monitor to kind of manage twitch and stuff makes it really really difficult for me so once I get that I should be okay to go um, I do maybe want to buy a new headset like I do have a decent one but I might maybe just get a better one like a wireless one because I hate being restricted and stuff like that so yeah anyways I hope you guys enjoy my tour of this area sorry if it's kind of like disorganized um, or just not explained that well or just awkward I'm very awkward apparently but yeah anyways I'm starting up a game now so I gotta go but um, yeah I already like pre-filmed the tour so I hope you guys enjoy that and thank you so much for watching okay so we will start with kind of how I did my bedroom tour of just kind of an overall view I'm sorry about the glare or anything like that um but this is my kind of general setup and everything like that so this area is like kind of like a loft area in our house that's why it's like there's stairs and stuff over here and then it comes up i am pretty thankful that my parents have let me set it up as my own little area considering like it's not like closed off or anything it's like very super like open and everything and you can just see all of this stuff which i'm sure like isn't the norm for a lot of houses I would think just to have a bunch of World of Warcraft stuff but that's what we're using it as. The first thing I have here is a sword that I got for Christmas a long time ago. It's from Lord of the Rings. It's Arwen's sword and I made a whole video about that a long time ago. Um, I have one of these kind of star light things that like turns on and it looks really cool at night. Don't really use it often though and then I have a few of my World of Warcraft cups. Um, my Deathwing pop final thing, which I got rid of the box for, unfortunately. Um, this little statue I got from Anime North. I also just wanted to mention there's a lot of stuff that I have, like, along here that I'll get into, and it's just stuff that I took out of the collector's editions just to, like, show them off and stuff, so... Yeah, um, so this is from the Burning Crusade Collector's Edition, the CD. Um, this is something that came with my World of Warcraft uh, Battle for Azeroth Collector's Edition that I just laid out. Um, this Warcraft trading card game thing, I got at Value Village. Uh, these are some mouse pads that came out of collector's editions. This is from, uh, the Burning Crusade. Where there's a Draenor, and then this mouse pad I ordered online on eBay or something like that. Um, over here I have a few more pop finals. We have our little Murky, um, Harley Quinn, uh, Reaper, oops, <laughs> um, Illidan, Thrall, Sylvanas, um, the Lich King, and King Lane, which I just got recently. And then up here I have my little bag that my Windrider Cub plush came in. Um, these are two images that came out of this original Warcraft 3 collector's edition thing, and I just thought they looked cool, so I put them up. Um, this is the art book from the Burning Crusade collector's edition, from the Cataclysm one, Burning Crusade CD, Cataclysm DVD, sorry. That is kind of this area, so it's just kind of like extra stuff that didn't fit over here kind of thing. Here I just kind of have some junk and also this area underneath of this desk is just literally junk, extra old monitors, a cat blanket, just random stuff, but I do have my Hearthstone pillow down here and then I also have this Illidari bag which my um, mischief pet toy plush thing came in. Um, over to this area, so what this stuff is sitting on is actually the hutch that would go up above my desk, but I didn't want to have a hutch because it didn't leave enough room for my computer and everything, so I'm just using that as like a shelf for this, and I just put this like material that my boyfriend's mom gave me over top of it to make it purple 
and sparkly. Um, along here I have again basically just a bunch of stuff that like either came out of collector's editions or just like boxes of things. So this is a Warlords of Draenor DVD. Um, original WoW, this is actually the original first um, game when my brother bought it like back in 2005 or 2006. I can't even remember. I think there were seats in here but that's like the original when we got started and I'm really glad my brother let me keep that. Um, Cataclysm D DVD. Uh, Cataclysm DVD, Cataclysm box game thing, which I actually have two of these, I don't know where the other one is. Or those are Draenor CD, and the Mists of Pandaria case. Uh, then here we have the Lich King CD, and oh, there's my Cataclysm case. Like I said, I have two of them. Uh, Wrath of the Lich King DVD, just a little book that came out of the trading card deck thing that I got as well from Value Village. Uh, Wrath of the Lich King, and... I'm sorry, I actually do have two of these. I'm not sure which one. I think this one is the original, but again, I just have duplicates of a lot of stuff. Over to here, I have this random axe that I actually just got this Halloween. One of my coworkers had it um, as part of their Halloween costume, and they got it from the dollar store, and they were going to throw it out, so I took it. Thought it looked like a Warlords of Draenor kind of axe thing. More WoW Cups, my Frostwolf Pup, Windrider, WoW Cup, Mischief, WoW Cup. Um, in behind here, I just have some cutout like calendar pictures that I stuck in the back of this like shelf thing. Um, I got this shelf from work. It was just like something they were going to throw out, like a piece of cardboard, and I thought it worked kind of, sort of, as like a shelf. We also have my little fairy dragon pet here, which I love because the tail can like curl up and stuff. Um, then I do have my Horde hat and my Illidari hat, and underneath of this is my very first like cosplay thing that I ever tried to do. Um, I tried to make White Mane Staff, but it's pretty bad. I don't really know, it's just kind of whatever. It's not, it's not that cool, but I'll try to give you like a backed up version of it. It's not that cool, but I keep it because it's like memories of like my first attempt at doing anything. Mm -hmm. um, then I also have my Harley Quinn Goodnight bat that I got off like Amazon or something one year for Halloween. So I just keep that there too because it's cool. I have a Warcraft movie poster which friend slash subscriber who works at Cineplex brought it to me at work one day. It was just like, here, they were going to throw this out and I know you like it. And I was like, sick. That's cool. Um, then I have my Sylvanas Windrunner poster which I freaking love. I got that off the Blizzard website. Down below that we come to, this is like my favorite area, like just right here. It's freaking amazing. Um, so we have Warcraft, Battle Chest, which I've had for a really, really super long time. Um, don't really remember when I got that. Um, this is from the World of Warcraft Battle for Azeroth Collector's Edition. It's the book um, A Good War and whatever. I literally can't remember the name of the other one, but it's like the Horde and Alliance perspectives of the story. Um, in Battle for Azeroth. I have a Warlords of Draenor book back there which came from the collector's edition. This little Wrath of the Lich King pamphlet thing. I just put stuff out because it just looks cool because why not. Um, then I have the Wrath of the Lich King art book, Wrath of the Lich King collector's edition, um, Burning Crusade, Cataclysm. Um, this one is Warlords of Draenor and then this is our newest I'm just knocking stuff over um, Battle for Azeroth. So I just kind of put the best ones at the top obviously best expansion ever so those ones went at the top but then I also really loved Burning Crusade and I thought Cataclysm was really sick too and I just like the artwork on the boxes the best so that's super sick. So I want to point out because I kind of missed these I have this little um, Blade of Azanoth keychain thing and also this Frostmourne one as well which is really cool so I hope that I kind of explained this well here's kind of like an again an overall look at everything. I think it looks so awesome. I love all of my last stuff. It's sick. That's like the background of my little area and I need another poster there because I know it doesn't look, it looks kind of empty over there. Um, but then over to here we just have this cool little window and a high ceiling which I really really like. But then right here is the actual area where I sit down and play my games and all that fun stuff. So um, up here we have a Sylvanas Windrunner poster of course, wall scroll kind of thing. That nice fabric-y kind of material. Um, I have my old World of Warcraft calendar. It's just on December still because I did buy the new one, but it's at my boyfriend's house still and I have to bring it over here. So, yep, that's what that is. Um, on top of here, I just have my 
headset, which I really don't use a whole lot because I normally am not talking to people because I play alone a lot. Um, so Steel Series, I think Siberia V2 or something like that. It's really, really nice. I do love it, but I just don't use it a whole lot. Here is my desktop computer, which I got from Dell. I did it as like a finance thing where I could pay it off over a year interest free. So I've almost had it for I think eight or nine months. So I still have a few months left to finish paying it off. So it just has like blue LEDs. They're looking kind of purple on camera, but I promise you it's blue. I wish that it was purple. Usually my boyfriend's going to help me get a new like clear case kind of thing and put like extra like LED lights and like water cooling and stuff in it and we'll just like move everything over. I think he said we need to buy like a new motherboard but other than that everything else can like come out of it or something. He's a computer genius. I don't really know a whole lot. Um, I'm really not even sure what type of computer this is so I will just either put it in the description or as a caption here um, the exact one that I got. Um, all I know is it works really good. I don't have any issues with lagging. It's all very smooth. It hasn't caused any issues for me so that's really really awesome. I super love it a whole lot and I love having a desktop computer way more than a laptop. It is so nice. Moving on, this is my monitor. It is a 27 inch HP something rather. I'll again put that in the caption or either in the description. I'm just really not good with like computer stuff. My boyfriend helps me with all of that type stuff. Um, so I do have my webcam here which I use obviously if I do stream on Twitch I use that or if I ever make a video with my webcam that's what I use. Um, then I also have this sick um, Razer Naga keyboard which I literally again forget exactly which model it is. It's like really super good and you can program all the LEDs and stuff in it to like strobe or like do a bunch of stuff. I just have it like transitioning right now between a bunch of different colors. I just have these random cheap <laughs> um, speakers that I got off Amazon. They were like $20. They're Logitech. I don't really know. This is my mouse pad. I just have my Cataclysm mouse pad. I will sometimes switch it out with like the other ones that I have over here but I'm really liking that one right now. Um, my mouse is a really crappy one off Amazon again. It looks pretty cool I would say but I don't really know like what the brand is. I used to have a razor mouse but it died on me and I just was too <laughs> broke to buy a new one. Um, so yeah that is that. My desk is just like a basic black color. Um, yeah and then this is my awesome DX racer. I love the color scheme so 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 much. It's like black purple and white which is like literally my whole aesthetic so that is awesome. Um, this was like a really awesome like kind of treat myself kind of because it was like three four hundred dollars I don't entirely remember but this chair is so comfortable I love it so much I could sit here all freaking day I actually do also have a mirror and I sometimes do just like sit here and while I'm playing like either World of Warcraft or Heroes like in between like if I die on Heroes or when I'm waiting to start up a game I will like do my makeup <laughs> like I'll quickly do it for like 30 seconds go back to gaming quickly do my makeup like it's it's a whole thing <laughs> and then if I'm playing WoW like anytime if I'm like on a flight path or like waiting for like a, a queue for something while I'm waiting I just do my makeup so yeah anyways so this is everything I think I covered everything I'm sorry if this wasn't as glamorous or like as well explained as you guys were hoping to um, I just really wanted to show you guys my little area because this is where I spend like all of my time it's so fantastic I love being here so I hope you guys enjoyed that video. If you have any questions or comments or anything, leave them down below. I will be sure to reply to as many as I possibly can. Um, and I also do have two videos planned that should be coming out within the next couple days to a week or so. Um, I'm I'm going to be doing this like 200 questions thing that I answered like in 2012 on my Facebook. It's like really cringy and like kind of a get to know like the old Brooke kind of thing and it'll be pretty funny. And then I'm also planning to do a dare video soon as well. My phone is just going off. Um, but yeah, if you guys have any other dare suggestion things that you want to see me do, please let me know because I definitely want to do a few more. I have a couple, but I'd like to do a couple more things. So if you have any other dares or anything like that for me to do or just video suggestions, please let me know. And thank you so much for watching to the end of the video and I will talk to you guys again soon. Bye!